19.3, when you talk about prepare a standard solution by diluting a concentrated solution of a known molarity. So um, this time we're going to prepare a 250cm cube of 0 0.0120M sodium carbonate solution from a more concentrated sodium carbonate solution. So you can see that this one is 0 0.12, this one is 0 0.012. Okay, so we we'll have one more zero right there. So the chemical that we use this one is a stock solution. We have 0 0.12 m sodium carbonate solution. So first of all, we have to calculate how much volume of this stock solutions need to prepare or 250 of this one. Okay, so because in this case, okay, we are diluting the the stock solutions into a diluted bond. Okay, so therefore we have to uh, use the equation m one v one equals to m two v two. Okay, so uh, the the final volume of solutions is two hundred fifty cm cube. So this one will be v two, and this is the molarity that we want. So therefore that will be m two. Okay, and original molarity will be m one. So by doing so, so, okay, we can just put this. Our data so we into the equation then you will find that this is 0 0.12 times v1 where m2 will be 0 0.012 okay and then times v2 remember it should be in dm cube so therefore you convert the cm cube into dm cube so it is not difficult to find that this one will be 0 0.025 dm cube which is equals to 25 cm cube okay so uh, this is the very first step okay we have to know how much stock solution how much stock solution is required to prepare the standard solutions that we want so uh, like what we have done before okay after we do the calculations we know the volume required okay and then we'll use a pipette which can uh, transfer a specific volume accurately. We transfer 25 cm cube okay, of the solutions and put it into a we put it into the volumetric flask directly. After you take the solutions, you put it into the volumetric flask directly. Okay, so we use the word transfer right here. Transfer to, remember you have to tell them, okay, uh, the volume of the volumetric flask used. Right here, I just use V flask, okay, but remember when you write the essay, you have to write the full name, volumetric flask, okay? So uh, we transfer it to, the volume is 250 cm cube, we use this time, and then afterward, okay, it is easy. We just add this to water, Okay, till the bottom of the meniscus reach the graduation mark. So this is the graduation mark. Okay, we have the bottom of the meniscus. Okay, like this one. Okay, remember the curvature. Okay, the bottom of the meniscus touch the graduation mark. Then that would mean that okay, the volume inside will 250 cm cube. Okay, precisely. Okay, what we need to do next will be stopper the flask and then mix it well. Okay, so this is. <coughs> Basically, okay, the process to prepare standard solutions. Okay, I just want to remind you, uh, one litre actually is equals to 1,000 cm cube, which is also equals to 1 dm cube. Okay, uh, we have to talk about this because in this videos, okay, uh, foreign countries, they try to use litre instead of dm cube. Okay, so actually it is the same. So uh, you can scan the QR code right there to see how people to prepare a standard solution, okay, by diluting a concentrate bomb. So uh, after you do uh, the process, okay, remember you have to calculate the final molarity of the standard solutions as well, okay? But actually normally it will be uh, the same, okay? Because you use a very accurate pipette, okay, to measure the volumes that required. But anyway, okay, right here, uh, this is the volume, this is the molarity, is diluted to. So this one will be the final volume. This is V2. Then this one is V1, M1. Okay. So we need to calculate the molarity of the diluted one. So we are looking for M2. So M1, V1 equals to M2, V2. M1 will be 2.5 here. V1 will be 10 over 1000. M2 will be something that we're looking for. Okay, V2 will be 250 over 1000. Okay, by doing the conversion, you will find that 0 0.100 molarity. 
okay so it would be like that uh you can see your palm one actually is okay because you're using two decimal places here okay so you use two would be all right okay but zero point one old molarity that will be good okay but if you say zero point one molarity okay you will risk okay a mock deductions right there okay oh next okay the procedures okay basically you remember some keywords okay you have to calculate the volume of original solutions okay and then use remember tell them uh, what pipette you're using and the verb or the verb that we're using is transfer okay remember you have to tell the volume of the volumetric flask pay attention to spelling add water till the bottom of the meniscus reach the graduation mark stopper and mix well and calculate the molarity again okay so this is the procedure that you have to follow Okay, so have a look of class practice 19.2, okay? So student prepared a uh, 500 cm group of 0 0.1 M standard even dioic acid solutions by dissolving hydrated. Hydrated means without water. Oh, sorry, with water, not without. Hydrated. Even dioic acid crystal in water, okay? So uh, this one is dissolving solid, okay? And there are solutions and prepare stand solutions. So first part, you have to calculate the mass of hydrated even dioic acid. Okay, so you got M, you got V right here. First of all, you calculate the number of mole first. So number of mole of COOH bracket 2 dot 2 H2O. So this one will equals to M times V. So it will be 0 0.1, V will be 500 over 1000, okay? So this one, the first part will be 0 0.05 mole, okay? After you get the mole, okay, you have to calculate the mass, okay? Mass of COOH bracket 2 dot 2H2O. So this one will be number of mole times molar mass, okay? Molar mass, which will be 12 plus 16 times 2 plus 1 times 2. Okay, so this part will be the first part, and then plus 18 times 2. Okay, remember this is a plus sign for this one, okay? So put a square bracket for that. So um, the mass okay, that required would be 6.3 gram, okay, in total. So you use 6.3 gram of crystal to prepare these solutions, okay? Roughly will be 0 0.1 M, okay? However, you can see that, okay, not every time you exactly get 6.3 gram. So if the student weight out is 6.45, a little bit more than 6. 3 okay we need to calculate the new molarity okay of the solutions prepared okay so part b if we have 6.45 okay the number of mole number of mole of the solutions okay that we have will be equals to 6.45 over the molar mass i'm not going to write this out again okay uh it should be one two six Okay, so it will be 0 0.0512 M. Okay, that will be the number of mole. The molarity of the solution, okay, will then equal to 0 0.0512 because we made up 500 cm cubed. So therefore, you will divide it by 0 0.5. So make up will be 0 0.102 mole per dm cube. So it makes sense, okay, it is close to 0 0.1 M, close to this one, okay. Uh, and then part C is a solution prepared in B a standard solution. Remember standard solutions, it means that solution with accurately known molarity. So known molarity. So right now you know the molarity accurately. So therefore, yes, it is a standard solution. Okay, the reason because the molar concentration or molarity of the solution is accurately known. Remember, accurately, this word is very important. Okay, and then part D, okay, to prepare a 250cm cube of 0 0.015m, even dioic acid. What is the volume of solutions prepared in B required, okay, for dilution? So this one is dilution, you have M1V1 equals to M2V2. So the M2V2, in this case, okay, we are preparing this M2, and we have prepared this V2 as well. So our uh, part D, M1 V1 equals to M2 V2. So M1, the first one will be this one, 0 0.102, but you don't know the volume. And the M2 will be 0 0.0150, and then V2 will be 0 0.25, okay? So do the math. V1 will equals to 0 0.0368 dm cube that means 
you roughly need 36.8 cm cube. Get it? Some of you may wonder, 36.8 cm cube, do we have a pipette for that? The answer is no. Okay, we don't have a pie patch to be that specific. 36.8 cm cube. However, we can use other apparatus to help us. Okay, in this case, okay, I will recommend you to use Beret instead. Okay, later on you'll know that Beret is also a very accurate apparatus. Okay, but it can deliver or transfer a variable solutions. Okay, so uh, that would be like this. So uh, typical essay questions, okay, so normally, okay, in public exam, you have these kind of essay questions. Remember, if it is question number eight, you will see there's a star in front of it. Star means that it is uh, questions required to write in a complete sentence, okay, and also try to be in paragraph form, okay, and with good grammar and things like that. So you have an effective communication mark right there, okay. So uh, this is uh, asking you to describe the procedures prepare 100 cm cube 0 0.5 m sodium carbonate solutions from 5.3 gram of uh, solid and hydrosodium carbonate so all the highlighted point okay dissolve it with this two water put it into 100 cm cube volumetric flask wash it okay and pour all the washing into volumetric flask then uh, the bottom add water up to or i prefer the bottom of meniscus reach the graduation mark okay stopper and invert finally you're going to calculate the molarity so basically it will be like this okay add all the keywords in it okay and make a complete sentence and you score the final effective communication mark so uh in summary okay to procedures to prepare standard solutions by dilution you need to calculate volume first okay by m1 v1 equals m2 v2 okay and then remember you use pipette to transfer the um stock solution in general okay and remember you have to tell them what uh, volume volumetric flask you can use okay and then add water until the bottom of meniscus reach graduation mark and also stop the solution or stop the flask mix it well okay at the end okay you have to calculate the molarity one more time okay so uh, pay attention to effective communication you must have a complete sentence okay and also no point form that's all for this video bye bye